Do you see this goblet? asks Ajahn Shah, the Thai meditation master. For me, this glass is already broken. I enjoy it, he says. I drink out of it. It holds my water admirably, sometimes even reflecting the sun in its beautiful patterns. If I should tap it, it has a lovely ring to it. But when I put this glass on the shelf and the wind knocks it over or my elbow brushes it off the table and it falls to the ground and shatters, I say, but of course, when I understand that the glass is already broken, every moment with it is precious. The glass truly is already broken. Our lives, a beautiful dance on broken glass. When I remind myself of this, that the glass is borrowed and not bought, it sometimes saddens me. I think of my life and I think of what I've lost or what could have been. And the glass feels frail to me in those moments and fractured. And it's foisted on a feeble frame, which is mine, always waiting to regret and to wish things were otherwise, and sometimes even to weep. But true mindfulness is the great enemy of this sort of sadness, because life, regardless of where you've been, it's always right here, right now, and only in this moment. Through that lens, I begin to think again, and I begin to recognize and feel this great sense of gratitude for what is truly here, right now. I remember seeing the late, great author, Christopher Hitchens, at a debate, and he was already sick. And as you could see from his appearance, as he said so well, more and more was being taken from less and less. And in that spirit, it was obvious to all. The host asked him, well, how are you feeling? And he said, well, I'm dying, but so too are you. And the audience laughed, and of course, nervously at first, but then with the benefit of contemplation in the moment, they started to laugh louder and more comfortably with the silly, simple truth of it all. And so it is for all of us, the mindfulness of impermanence it's the great motivator for me. It's really all borrowed time. And what we do with it matters. So don't wait, just begin again. And wherever you've been, it doesn't matter. Just start now. It's a beautiful dance on broken glass. Teach what you know, do what you love, wake up the world with your work.